In this lecture, I am going to explain about tunnel diode. This is a topic in third BSc, Semester 5, Physics Paper. Unit 4, Basic Electronics. Now coming to tunnel diode. Tunnel diode is a high conductive two terminal PN junction diode doped heavily about 1000 times higher than a conventional junction. That is, tunnel diode is, a, is nothing but a PN junction diode doped heavily about 1000 times higher than the conventional diode. This tunnel diode shows negative resistance in the power wire. This is the speciality of the tunnel diode. Tunnel diode works on the principle of quantum mechanical time. And this diode was devised or invented by a Japanese scientist Leo Isaki. Hence, it is also called as Isaki diode. So, if you want to compare between those two, why uh, the doping concentration is increased? First, we should know about the conventional PN diode. So, in conventional PN di diode, it is doped by impurity atoms in the concentration of 1 part in 10 power 8, which means for 10 to the power of 8 semiconductor atoms, one impurity atom is added. With this doping, the depletion layer is relatively wide and there exists a potential barrier across the junction. Due to this potential barrier, holes from P to N region and electrons from N to P region cannot cross the junction. So, the charge carriers are not able to cross the junction with this normal doping that is 1 part in 10 power 8. Now, if the concentration of impurity atoms is greatly increased in PN junction about 1000 times, that means for 10 to the power of semiconductor atoms, 1000 dopants are added. So, with this increased doping, the depletion layer, layer width reduces to 100 angstroms are 10 to the power of minus 6 centimeters which means 1 micro. So due to this decrease in dip, uh, width of the depletion layer, the device characteristics are completely changed. So this heavy doping produces the following effects like width of depletion layer is reduced, reverse breakdown voltage reduces to a very small value, it produces a negative resistance section on IV characteristics. Now, in order to understand about tunnel diode, one should know about the tunnel effect. So, according to classical mechanics, a particle with energy, kinetic energy, E, cannot penetrate a barrier height H if E is less than H. So, here you can see the kinetic energy of the particle is less than the barrier energy. So in order to cross this barrier, the particle should have an energy E equal to or greater than V. Then only this particle comes from this side to this side. So at present there is no possibility according to classical mechanics. Now according to quantum mechanics, every particle is associated with waves which are said to be de Broglie waves. So due to this wave nature, there is a finite, finite probability. So, there is a probability that the particle can tunnel through the barrier even though its kinetic energy is less. So, even though the kinetic energy of the particle E is less than the barrier energy V, due to this wave nature, the particle may penetrate through the junction and it reaches the other side of the barrier. So this quantum mechanical phenomena of penetration is called as tunnel effect. So tunnel effect is mainly on the basis of quantum mechanics. Hence this penetration is said to be quantum mechanical tunneling and on this principle only the tunnel diode works. Now coming to tunnel diode. The tunnel diode is, is nothing but a PN junction diode which is heavily doped. So the circuit symbol of tunnel diode is just like a PN junction diode. Here 
there is a change in the symbol of cathode that is in anode and then cathode. Now coming to the forward bias because the main characteristic of the tunnel diode is in forward bias only. We know that when P type of the diode is connected to positive of the battery and N type is connected to negative of the battery, this connection is said to be forward bias. Now coming to the characteristics. These are the VI characteristics of tunnel diode. Voltage current characteristics, voltage ampere characteristics, or VI characteristics of tunnel diode. Nothing but a curve between voltage across the junction and current through the junction by taking the values of voltage on x-axis and current on y-axis. Now coming to the characteristic. As soon as the voltage is applied, forward voltage is applied to the tunnel diode, a significant current is produced. The current quickly reaches to a peak value IP when the applied forward voltage reaches to the value VP. So this point is said to be peak current and is represented by A here. Now this current variation in the vicinity of the horizon is due to quantum mechanical tunneling of electrons through narrow space charge region of the junction. So, as the voltage increases from 0 to Vp, the current increases from 0 to Ip. So, this fast increase in current is only due to quantum mechanical tunnel. When the forward voltage is increased beyond this value Vp, the voltage is slowly increasing in this manner. So, if the value increases beyond Vp, then the current decreases. As you can see in this graph, the current decreases and uh, this point is said to be valley point. The voltage corresponding to this valley point is said to be valley voltage Vv and the cur current corresponding to this point is said to be valley current I. And this is represented by the uh, point B. Now, from this graph, one can see that from the point A to B, the current decreases as the voltage increases. The voltage is, is increased in this manner. So, the current you can see here from the point A, the voltage decreases. From Ohm's law, we know that as voltage increases, current increases. In that case, V is equal to IR, R is said to be positive resistance. But here, as the voltage increases, the current decreases. Hence, this region is said to be negative resistance region. And this is the uh, useful property and interesting property of the tunnel diode. So, in fact, the portion AB constitute the most useful property. That is, the region AB, that is in here, instead of absorbing power, the negative resistance produces power. So in case of tunnel diode, in this particular portion, instead of absorbing power, it produces power. Hence, tunnel diode can be used as very high frequency oscillator. So, for the voltage greater than Vv. So, if you increase the voltage beyond this value point, then the characteristics are similar to ordinary PN junction diode, that is conventional diode. So, this is about the tunnel diode.